This clip is brought to you by SaveWithConrad.com. You're going to watch one Steiner brother match today. I'm going to recommend it be the Halloween Havoc 90 match where the Steiners pick up a win over the nasty boys. We recently talked about that one in the archives for Halloween Havoc 90, such an outstanding match. Let's fast forward to the first of the year though, February 18th, 1991. There's a title change that would air on March 9th. They win the tag team titles from the Freebirds, And subsequently they vacate the U S tag team championship. And I guess they're the, uh, only the second team to hold both of them at the same time. I think the Midnights did that back in September of 88. Fast forward to the next month though, and we're not done collecting hardware. The Steiners are going to win the IWGP tag titles uh, from Hase and Sasaki. Phenomenal match. Phenomenal. That's another one. If you have the time to, you want to watch some really good, high quality tag team wrestling featuring the Steiners. Hey, look, am I, for my money, at one time, Hiroshi Hase was one of the, the best in the entire world. Yes. And, you know, Shivani and I got to go to, uh, Tokyo and we did wraparounds for the, uh, uh, WCW new Japan event there. And they that's where that happened. I'm not sure. I guess it might be, I'm not sure. Anyway, uh, they're phenomenal. So that's another one. If you're a tag team aficionado, that's a word I can't spell, can barely say, but, uh, that's a good one to check out. No doubt. Hey, by the way, Conrad, I want to tell you, I was reading the notes here and it, it just, just now popped in my head. Uh, the nasty boys and the Steiners was a slug fest, right? And the, the champions were the nasty boys and the rumor in any window before it's time said the nasty boys didn't want to lose the title to the Steiners. And ironically, the agents were reluctant to discuss such finish with the, with the two teams didn't know how to, they were, they were intimidated. Well, I knew that the nasty boys who I liked still do. And, uh, the Steiners who were my two, two of my guys weren't going to beat me up, but I had to state the obvious. The nasty boys were leaving. They were going to Vince. Right. I said, guys, come on. What's hard. What's hard about this? You're going to lose to one of the greatest teams in the history of wrestling. Now I got them all sitting in the same room now. Cause I wanted the nasties to, to say what their reluctance was on putting the Steiners over and don't give me that. Well, Vince is going to be hot. Vince don't give a shit. Yeah. He don't watch this. No, he don't watch his own product. No. So come on, man. So anyway, uh, happy times prevailed handshakes all around. They hugged each other, all brothers. We all love each other. And then they commenced to go out there and I said, and what you guys should do tonight is steal the goddamn show, beat the shit out of each other, give people something to remember. And here we are, Conrad, uh, what? 30 years later, yeah. a little 31 years. We're, and we're still talking about it. And I, I like to think that little, that was just a way. Cause I, I wasn't threatening their position. I wasn't a shooter. I didn't want their job. I was just trying to help out. And, uh, they, I think they appreciated because guess what I did? I communicated, right? I was honest. I was up front and I wasn't confrontational and they got it. And, uh, they went out there and did their business. And, and, uh, I thought, uh, accounted very well for themselves. So they were moving on to bigger pastures and more potential money, et cetera. So, uh, it can be done if you're willing to get all the involved parties in a set down at the being. <laughs> we're we're the plethora of uh, of uh, sopranos references today conrad hey hey it's conrad thompson thanks for checking out the podcast here on youtube be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notifications bell so you get a notice anytime we upload some new content and go save yourself some money right now if you're in a 30-year loan or you have credit card debt it's not a matter of if i can save you money it's a matter of how much find out right now for free at savewithconrad.com